Okay guys, thanks for tuning in to your review channel. So today I picked up something different. I picked up something from uh, SenseGuy. Uh, so what this here is, is a LED uh, strip light kit. Uh, and so what I'm going to be doing is installing this into a bookcase. So feel free to subscribe to, to my channel and also you'll be notified when you see the installation and putting this into basically a bookcase. Uh, so what I did receive uh, was the LED strip light uh, cord. Basically, um, this is uh, motion active, different availabilities here. So I got the IR cabinet sensor. Uh, so basically what that means is infrared, I believe. Uh, so what it does is when it detects when the door opens, the lights will go on. And when I close the door to the cabinet, the lights will close, uh, will shut off. Uh, so this does come with the kit as well. Come with the, uh, the sensor, comes with some extra strips and some cables. And let's take a look at this together. Um, different color temperatures they do offer. This one is 3,000 to 3,500 Kelvin, so you know. Uh, so this kit does come with two different size um, strips inside. They give them different size, uh, let's see here what we have. So, and this is my first time actually purchasing something from this company. I wanted to hook up some type of uh, lighting on the cabinet. This is what I wanted to go with. So you know, use a manual, seems to be pretty basic. Give you some ideas on lighting so you can see here how the cabinets and the lighting. You can hook this up in your closet. Hook this up in a gun safe if you have. And this is what's in the kit here. So you see the power supply. You see the roll of LED lights. You get some, you get, um, let's see number five. They're calling that short extension cables, okay. Uh, number four is a connector and comes with the actual sensor itself, which is the cabinet sensor switch. So that's within this kit here. I'll leave a description down below uh, if you're interested in something like this for yourself. But this is kind of cool, I like this. I just wanted to do the unboxing and just show you. So these are the extension clips here. Uh, so basically you just cut the strip of LED lights, you put them in these clips here and you can extend them here. So if you have a cabinet between two cabinets and you want to run a jumper, basically, that's what this kind of is. And this comes with three of these, as you can see. And so far, the quality built is actually not bad at all. I do like that. It does come with a, a power supply here. Again, nice quality, pretty hefty. Um, all in all, the build seems pretty nice. Now, this is the sensor I was telling you about. So let's take a look at this together. So let's see here. So it comes with double-sized tape here so you can mount this on the door. So let's say the door is going to open and close. And here is the actual sensor itself. And there's different configurations you can purchase with this kit. Like I said, you can get a, a daylight switch, you can get um, a wave dimmer sensor, all kinds of different things here. Motion activated sensor. They have different kits available so you can pick what you want. But I wanted this for the cabinet. So basically it has the RF, I believe a switch here, signals when the door closes, it, it knows it's closed, shuts it off and the door opens. It, it knows the door is open by the light being broken between the sensor probably, or it reads it, um, the RF signal, I believe. Um, and then the light will power on. Uh, so that's how that kind of works. So you just mount that near the door and when the door opens and closes, basically turns on and off the light. And that's how that works. Let's see what we have here. So this is the actual strip itself. Okay, let's take a look at that. It's over here. And packaging is well made. And the well, nice, nice quality packaging. Did a nice job with that. <clears throat> and let's see that out of the way. Cool. So here is the LED, so you can see here. It's already mounted on one side and soldered and ready to go, okay? Here's the other side here of the actual switch. And if you wanna just run this through a wall or something, it has the two screws you can unscrew and you just pop that right through and you can have this on the other end. So this is really easy to disconnect and reconnect. So that's easy to do, okay? It does have uh, 3M double side tape on the back. And again, high quality uh, self adhesive tape, which is kinda of cool. You just pull this off and you stick it right to any surface you want, either under a cabinet or wherever you want. And then you have the cut lines. And if you can see here, the cut lines are right here. And as we cut with the scissors, you got positive and negative, so you just follow those exactly, and you really can't make a mistake. You can't mess up on this at all. This really works really, really well. But I wanna just give this a quick test and just a quick unboxing to show you. Let me plug in the power. Okay guys, so I plugged it in. So we're just gonna do a straight plug-in. So basically I'm just giving it straight power uh, right from the uh, outlet with no switch whatsoever. So here is straight power, you can see it goes on immediately, okay? Everything is all lit. You can see it's nice and bright. I like the warm light personally, uh, especially in on the cabinets or in closets. It's just a nice warm light. Uh, just give you, just, just illuminate the area, which that's what it's all about.
Okay, so let's take that off. Now let's add the switch on, just to show you how the switch works, okay? Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you're enjoying my videos. I do appreciate it as always. It does help me out quite a bit, as you all know. Okay, so light is on, door closes, lights off. Door open, lights on, door closes, lights off. So you can see how that works, right? That is pretty cool. Check that out. And I'm gonna put this in the cabinet and you're gonna see, so don't forget to subscribe to the video. That way you can see the video of me actually uh, putting it into a cabinet, setting this all up and just check it out how it works. All right, so far so good. I do like this. All right guys, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. I do appreciate it as always. As, and um, any other questions or comments, leave down below in the description. Um, so if you have any questions or any comments, leave down below in that comment section. I'll leave a link for this specific kit. Um, also in the description comment, uh, in the below in the comment section. If you are interested, I do appreciate it as always. This is awesome. I like this. This is going to work out real well. All right, guys, and I'll see you at the next review.